remember after the 2020 general election, I couldn't walk the length of myself without being told that we didn't run enough candidates. People stopped me in the street, at matches, at concerts, shouted it to me from car windows. Stop me in the supermarket. I couldn't buy a slice pan without somebody saying it to me. So, to you all, I now present Sinn Féin's record number of candidates for the local and the European elections. We're running our largest number of candidates and we are standing in every single electoral area. So this is, this is a really big team effort. And so I have asked a very big man from Donegal to act as campaign director. That would be the Bowles Pierce Doherty. My friends, we are the party of change. Change that means a roof over your head, a secure, affordable home. Change that means being able to see a doctor when you're sick, getting the right care in the right place at the right time. A future where life is affordable where a job provides a decent living and when you re can retire at 65 with your pension. Change that means safe communities, strong communities built from the grassroots up, protected by resourcing on Garda Siakana fully and by ambitiously investing in community development, in youth work, in the amazing talent and potential of our young people. Change means a government, a society that has the backs of ordinary people. <laughs> Friends, the greatest failure of this government is in housing. This is the most important local and European elections for a generation because of housing. Tens of thousands languishing on council housing lists, rip-off rents, a whole generation locked out of home ownership, and record and growing homelessness. Homes are out of reach because this government is out of touch. And the inability to find an affordable home, to lay down roots, to build a good life is driving so many young people out of Ireland in search of opportunity abroad. We say enough of that. It's now time to turn the tide. We want, we need our young people here in Ireland, our young people living abroad to have the opportunity to come back and pursue happiness at home. We want our economy to thrive, our society to blossom. Key to this is fixing housing. And that means delivering the biggest housing program in the history of the state. So a vote for Sinn Féin in these elections is a vote for affordable housing to rent or buy. A vote for Sinn Féin is a vote for more council housing. A vote for Sinn Féin is a vote to end the housing crisis. Sinn Féin has the plan. Sinn Féin has the man in Owen O'Brien. The government and the European Commission may seek to dismantle Ireland's neutrality, but we will defend it. <laughs> Commission President Ursula von der Leyen showed her hand when she stood shoulder to shoulder with Israel as they committed slaughter and war crimes against the people of Gaza. She did not stand for us. She did not speak for us. She never, ever will.
So it beggars belief that Fianna Fáil and Fine Gael MEPs will line up to give her a second term in office. We will not. We stand with the people of Palestine in their struggle for freedom, for statehood, for peace, for the end of apartheid and an end to the occupation. That's who we are. Out on the canvas, people are asking us, when are you getting this lot out of government? Yeah? Well, the truth is, if you want change, if you want to see the back of this failed government, then you have to show up and you have to vote for it. The first step is by voting for Sinn Féin on the 7th of June, backing Sinn Féin. We will work hard. We won't let people down because we're all in this together in the end. These next six weeks really, really matter. So, keep your shoulders to the wheel, keep working hard in your communities and standing up for people, keep believing, believing that we will achieve the Republic and a new Ireland. So let's do this, let's leave it all on the pitch and on the dance floor. Let's get the job done, let's deliver real change and a better future for everyone.